The Institution of Mechanical Engineers organises this competition each year uh, for Formula Student. Formula Student's a competition which brings together many universities. They bring their racing car, which they've been working on all year, to this competition to see how well the car performs and how well they work as a team. At universities, you're taught a lot of knowledge, but this is a project which allows you to practice that knowledge and develop a physical item. We're looking for engineers with a whole range of skills, team working, problem solving, they learn their project management skills, which makes them very employable at the end of this process as well. There aren't enough engineers now for all the opportunities that we have in the country. We're missing out on half the population, the young ladies who have a lot of the skills and talent that would make them good engineers. They should do engineering because it's a great career and the, these companies need their particular skills. In the last few years we've seen the different power systems coming through and will this be the year where the electric car will win? My name is Marin Graupner and I'm studying mechanical engineering and this year I'm doing the team leadership of this car. Last year I worked in the combustion team and then we decided only to build electric cars um, to, to improve our skills on, on this new technology and um, the biggest benefit is the power <laughs> and the motor characteristic. Our car has um, a very high performance, it has 85 kilowatt at um, a torque from 1200 newton meter and of course there are no emissions. <laughs> I think envi environmental awareness is getting more important every day. <laughs> okay, so my name is Bradley, I'm part of the uh, Cape Peninsula of Technology uh, University team. It's based in Cape Town, South Africa, all the way down south. Um, and yeah, this is the first time that we've actually entered this event. Um, we've built, uh, designed, built and entered class one, which is the top class um, uh, for this event. And yeah, we, we're just happy to be here. We've been designing the car for about uh, two, two and a half years. Uh, design and build, manufacture, um, all homegrown, so it's all, all sort of locally produced. Um, and yeah, it's the same sort of students that are just coming over here now to, to actually race the car. And as you can see at the moment, we've got a bit of a, a breakdown, a big breakdown actually. Um, but yeah, we hope to have it done in about 20 minutes or so. Um, at half past four, we have to bracket scrutineering. Uh, what has happened is we went in the splint test and the uh, tie rod ends have shared off. Two of them have shared off, which obviously supports the suspension. So we just replaced it here at the moment. Uh, we then take it back to scrutineering um, and then we're going to be back on the track. Yeah, it would be great to go into motorsport. I think uh, it's every sort of engineer's dream really to do sort of either F1 racing or aerodynamics or that, that type of thing. Um, in South Africa, it is a bit limited because of the opportunities that aren't so much over there. They, 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 they're more in Europe. Um, however, we do feel that we've, there's, there's, enough, uh, there's enough of a niche market to be able to do this sort of thing. Uh, we do believe that with engineering skills and the engineering acumen, we can actually bring a lot to, uh, to, to the motorsport uh, industry as a whole. Uh, we're young, enthusiastic engineers, so, you know, Obviously at the institution we're absolutely delighted that we've, our membership now stands above 100,000 and it's still growing. Our members say to us that they really want us to make sure that we are promoting engineering to the next generation. So for me Bloodhound is a great example where people can do a different form of learning. You're sharing the knowledge and you're sharing it in such a way that some of it's at high intellectual value but the other is information that is very understandable and usable by young people as well. I think it's a great project to cause the conversation about engineering to happen. 
So uh, we're very pleased to be one of the sponsors uh, on the Bloodhound car.